Right, so we have Inform Insignia and we have Second Inform Akadi. I'm more looking forward to using Inform Insignia, to be honest, because I really like his non-inform. I've always liked Insignia's cards, purely because he's my type of player where he's quick, he's super agile, he's dribbling, he's stuck to his feet, you know, it's like... He's just really, really good players like that. I just really love agile players and really quick agile players, pretty much. His in-game stats are pretty good. It's a pity he doesn't have 99 balance yet. You know, last year he's, a lot of his cards had 99 balance, but he's getting there. 97 agility, 94 balance, pretty decent. His shooting stats aren't amazing, but his attacking position is nice and his curve is nice. So yeah, hopefully we can get get inside, cut inside, and do some finesse shots. And Icardi is, I, I liked his first inform, he's a clinical finisher, he's, he's what he is, he's a pure finisher. Get him in the box and he'll score, so yeah, I'm, I'm looking forward to using this second inform Icardi as well, because I liked his first inform. And there are the custom tactics, as you can see, they've not changed from the last time, well, the last video, so yeah, player instructions. He's getting behind, press back line on the on Icardi. On the wingers, he's getting behind, press back line as well. Centre, centre mid, stay back while attacking. The outside centre mids are unbalanced. And all the back four is on stay back while attacking. Let's get into a game anyway. Let's go. Let's see what team this guy has. It's, um... What? Okay. Yeah, Premier League and Bundesliga. Fair enough. Oh... <sighs> I have, uh, I, I'm bored of saying it, I'm not even going to say it, I'm not even going to say it, I, no, no, just, I'll just, yeah, fair enough, Insigne, yes, Insigne, that's, what is that, that's it, Deli, back to Icardi, get it, that's it, that's it, that's what I need to do, get Icardi inside the box, you are not stopping Icardi when he gets in that position, I don't, like, just, in, just get him inside the box, that's all he needs, just inside the box, and he is finishing everything. Because he is so clinical. He is every year. Every single year, that's what Akadi is. Get him inside the box, and he will finish. No, man. I've been I've been on top all this game. Honestly, I have I have dominated this guy. I, I I get I'm getting bored of saying it, but it, I've got to say it because it's the truth. The guys, I'm pretty sure the guy has had two shots on target. It's absolutely ridiculous. That's it, Quadrado. Finish it. There we go. Two all. I will kick off you. I will kick off you. I, I just... I don't even care. Like, that, it shouldn't be like that, though. That sh <laughs> kick off should not be a thing. It's so stupid. That's it. Insigne. Come on, Insigne! Oh, he's hit the ball! Insigne! <laughs> oh, my God, man. This is ridiculous. As if he's hit the ball. Icardi. Icardi. Icardi, yes, yes, I knew it, oh, that's, this such a lucky bounce to get into that position, but I knew that as soon as I got into that position, Icardi will finish, it's such a lucky bounce that, look at that, that's so lucky, but I will take the finish, it's so easy to finish with him, like, you don't even need to, like, do a low driven or anything, he just, I don't know, he just puts it into the back of the net. I will turn the 3-2 win, that guy was pretty decent, I did dominate him though, like, he, he caused me a few problems, but... I feel like I was in control most of the game. It's just I was struggling to get the goals at some points. So, yeah, Icardi, I think he got two goals. I'm not too sure. Maybe he got two goals. Uh, yeah, he got two goals. So, happy days. Nice one, Icardi. Let's see what team this guy has. A Premier League team. Okay. Oh, he's got Mkhitaryan at centre mid. Icardi, you can't, you can't make mistakes like that. I don't know what this guy was trying to do. But you can't make mistakes like that. Not when Icardi's in the box waiting. Not when Icardi is in the box. Like, this Icardi is so good at finishing, but I'm not I'm not too sure I like him in this lone striker formation. I think he's better in a two-striker formation, to be honest. I think it's just because I can't play 4-3-2-1 this year. I don't know. I just don't really like it as much as 4-3-1-2 this year. Oh, my God. This guy does not deserve this. Doesn't deserve it, but... I don't, I don't mind. I'm not that annoyed, to be honest. He is a good player. He d I don't think he deserves it, but like he is a good player. Icardi! Oh my god, that is so lucky. Oh my god. How has that gone in? Oh, I, but I queued a pause and I don't want to queue a pause now. Oh man, how... <laughs> I guess you just shoot with Icardi no matter what. Like As soon as you get in the box, just press shoot. 
and just hope for the best. I want to see the replay of this. But that's what I was going to do, I'd say. I'm next game, by the way, I'm changing formation to 4 3 1 2. I'm going to put Insignia at camp because honestly, 4 3 2 1 just isn't for me this year. It doesn't really work that well. I've, maybe it's just with this team, but honestly, it's really, I'm really struggling to create chances. Look at that with a card. I think he was going on target anyway, but that's lucky that he's hit his player and gone in. Wow. That's, that's unfortunate for him. Come on, Insigne. That's it to a card here. And a card here. Wow. Okay. Fair enough. Fair play. I love those finishes, man. Like, do you know when you play just place? Look at that. That is such a nice finish. Just angling his foot so it just bounces off his foot into the net. Go on, Icardi. Last, what a what a finish, man! I will take the three-one win. That that was honestly, like I said, I was really struggling to create chances in that game. It was pretty frustrating. So what I'm going to do in the in the last game is I'm going to switch formation up to four-three-one-two in game. I'm going to play Insigne at Cam and Icardi up up top with Quadrado. So yeah, let's see see if it's any different with that formation. Let's go. Let's see what team this guy has. Oh, okay, it's a bit of a different one. Well, it's a league gun team, but then he's got informed dust up top, so fair enough. Yeah, that's at least he's a bit different, you know? It's not, not your typical sweaty Premier League team or whatever. No, not dust. Not dust! Come on, man, he's like scuffed that in. <laughs> oh my god, why? Why, FIFA? Why'd you have to do this to me? As if that's gone in. That's it, Insigne. You might be injured, but you're still in. Let's go, please. Please go in. He's hit the post. He's hit the post. Insigne can't finish. Insigne legit can't finish. <laughs> Bas Dost runs onto the wing with his weaker foot, puts in a perfect cross, and Lucas out jumps my left back. Lucas out jumps Danny Rose. What is going on? I say Insigne. Good ball. Icardi. There we go. You're not stopping Icardi when he gets into that position. Yes, man. At least Insigne can play a decent through ball. Like, he can actually pass. He's just... He's shooting. He's so off. Like, it feels worse than the non-inform somehow. I don't... I don't understand why. It just... It does. Bastos from a corner. Bastos is the best striker in the game, apparently. Yeah. He just, he does everything. He does everything. I've, he's been unreal dribbling-wise as well. He's, he's felt, you know, really agile against me. You know, his, his, his ball control and his dribbling seems top-notch. Top Icardi's in. Icardi's in, and you're not stopping him. He, he, his goalkeeper did so well as well, but Icardi, I don't know why. He's just, as soon as he... It's like, once he gets in the box, it's like, guaranteed no matter what, it is going in the back of the net. It's so strange. It's so strange. It's like his finishing just glitches everything else out. It just stops everything else from stopping him. It's weird. It's so strange. Bast Dust! Bast Dust is unreal. I can't believe how crazy his dribbling feels. I can't get the ball off him when he takes a touch. It's actually stupid. Insigne is in. Are you going to finish Insigne? Oh my god, congratulations Insigne. You've finished. You've finished a goal. You've, you've put a, a, the ball in the back of the net. You've done a goal. Wow, okay. There we go. Oh, look at the stare of this guy. Look at him. Well, I'm going to be honest, didn't enjoy that game. I've, I've not really enjoyed this team, if I'm completely honest. I thought it was going to be the best one of the lot, considering this team pretty much is the best one of all the... The squad builders that I've done from this week's team of the week. I thought this was going to be the best, but it just isn't. Like, Insigne is he's, he's disappointing me big time. I'm just going to say it straight from the start. Do not buy him from Insigne. Just don't. Don't bother. He's poor. I, I am very, very disappointed in this Insigne. I, he feels like he's not in form. Do you know what? He's finishing actually so feels worse than the non form. I'm not even kidding. He is... He's finishing, his shooting actually feels worse than his non form somehow. And I don't know how that's a thing. I don't know how that's worked. But it, it does. And so, yeah, I'm not really, I'm not even going to say anything about this in form in here. Because, honestly, it feels like the non form but with worse shooting. Icardi, however, is obviously, we all know what Icardi's about. We know what he's about. Get him in the box, he'll score. So, yeah, this it's no different for this second in-form. I would say, I, I don't really like this formation. 
I don't know whether it's, in fact, I don't know whether it's this formation or whether it's just this team in general. But, yeah, I didn't really enjoy this team. Quadrado was terrible, by the way. But, yeah, same thing for McCauley. I would play him in a two-strike formation. Pace-wise, he felt exactly the same as the first in form. Do you know what? I'm going to just go out on a limb and say, he, he, well, he's not really going out on a limb. But he actually feels just like his first in form, if I'm completely honest. He doesn't feel much different at all. There's not any difference there that I can think of. Because his first in form, pace-wise, it's exactly the same. His first in form finishes just as well as his second in form. I know it's no difference. They're both really good finishers, so I don't think it really makes a difference. 68 passing, that's maybe the only thing I noticed is a slight little passing upgrade, but even then, he didn't feel that much better than his first in form. Uh, Dribbling-wise, again, the same as his first in form, and physical-wise... You know, it's, it's the first, same as his first in form, pretty much. So, yeah, that's all I'm going to say. He's, he's the same as his first in form. I wouldn't really recommend getting him for the price difference, if I'm honest. Wait until he gets a third in form. I think that's when his stats will really make a difference compared to his first in form. So, yeah, I wouldn't really say his second in form is worth it. Smash that thumbs up button and subscribe if you're new. Twitter, as always, is down below in the description. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.